YouTube, what's up? This is Dabo TCG back with another Hidden Fates tin opening. Like I said in the last video, I have six of these lying around, so I'm going to upload one opening a day. Um, just qu quick and short videos, you know. Uh, we're gonna enjoy some Hidden Fates openings. Don't want to take up too much of your time. Um, so yeah, let's just hop right into it. First tin wasn't so great. Hoping to get a little better luck out of this one. I have heard people saying that the shiny Charizard comes easier in the Raichu and the Gyarados tins, so let's hope that that's true for us today. So we got the Raichu promo already, so we got one ultra hit, put that over there, and I got the four packs. Alright, we are missing- oh, we so we got two of each artwork in this one, two Mews and two the birds, um, so let's dig into the birds. We're gonna get at least a couple shinies. The first one got a couple hollows, but nothing too crazy. So let's see. Genghis Khan and a Mew Rare. Here's a code. Next pack. Oh, looks like we got an, uh -huh, another Raichu GX out of the Raichu GX tin. Reverse Charmander. Nice, so we did get a hit. Next pack. Straight into it. Reverse Geodude in the Golem. The last pack of this tin. Did get an Ultra Rare, so this tin is already better than that first one. So I am not complaining at all. Last pack of magic. Let's see if we can get something. A Psyduck and a Weezing. Nothing out of that pack. Alright, it's kind of sorting everything. And of course, we've got the right promo. Alright, uh, short and sweet. Keeping it simple. Um, see you in the next video. back with the third Hidden Fates tin opening out of six and yeah without too much more talking let's just get straight into it. First two tins a little bit lackluster we were able to get a couple hollows out of the first one and out of the second one we were able to hit a ultra rare GX so let's see if we can actually pull some shiny Pokemon you know I swear they exist in this pack but we just haven't been able to get one yet so hoping to have a little bit better luck in this one let's keep it rolling. Gyarados promo, looking very nice. Let's get this out of here. Go over there, four packs. Sweet, we got every artwork this time. And let's just open them in order. See where that gets us. All right, first pack. Oh, awesome. And we got the shiny Umbreon GX. Wow, that's an amazing pull, you guys. I think this goes for around a hundred dollars just for the raw card these days. The centering looks awesome on the front. Um, it's a little off center on the back, but you know what? Gem Mint. We take those. Let me put it into a sleeve immediately. Awesome. Looks like our luck is turning around. So this one card almost makes up for like all three tins that I've opened up so far. But yeah, let's see what else we can get in this one. Wow, sweet pull. Leave this one over here. Rest of the pack. Nothing crazy. Let's keep it up. Mewtwo pack next. Alright, and... You got a reverse Vaporeon. Or, wait, no, sorry. Reverse Magmar and the Hollow Vaporeon. So we're keeping up with the evolutions. Not complaining. Alright, next pack. Oh man, I still can't believe we pulled that Umbreon. Definitely one of the most expensive chase cards in the set. Super happy with that. Oh, this pack just will not open. Alright, I'm just gonna slide it out. And we got... Okay, we got a Hollow Energy. That's kind of cool. I mean, even if we don't get anything out of this last pack, like, I'm already content with that Umbreon. But, let's see what it'll do.
Got a Bills Analysis Reverse and a Pinzer GX. So Ultra out of the last pack. Wow. So that tin definitely made up for the last two, which were a little bit lackluster. Um, but yeah, that was only three out of six. Stay tuned for three more tin openings over three days. I'm trying to keep these short and simple. And yeah, see you in the next one.